I can't believe I have never seen this movie before, but at long last, because I wanted to watch the sequel to get a movie on my list for my 2022 movies list, I decided to finally give this film a watch. Hi everyone, it's me Gaming Do, and today we are going to be reviewing Minions. You may be wondering, why are you reviewing Minions? Well, it has to do with the fact that, one, I already said it, I'm going to be reviewing The Rise of Gru pretty soon. But mainly, another reason is because this movie is like infamously hated as like one of the worst animated movies of all time. Um, lots of people think it's very annoying and it's very loathed and people just get very annoyed by this film, especially Yoshi Player, who wants this movie to burn in hell. And I finally saw this movie seven years after it came out. So, what do I think of this movie? It was... alright. It wasn't great or even good, but... You know what? I would be lying if I said I didn't see any charm in this film. Because there's a little bit. That being said... It's not great or even good because it does have some major problems. First of all, I'll give you a little bit of my history with the Despicable Me films. I only seen the first two. I really like the first one. And I like the second one just fine. And this is the third one I've seen. Um, I don't know if I'm going to see the third Despicable Me film anytime soon. That'll probably be the only one I skip on for now, but... Um... This film is definitely the worst out of them all that I've seen in this franchise so far. Well, this is technically a sub-franchise, but anyways. Um... Minions was alright. Nothing great, but it's not bad either. Let's get on with the positives. This film... I think my biggest positive with this film is... It's innocent. It doesn't mean any harm or anything. It's not trying to harm today's youth or anything or... It's just innocent, dumb fun. And if you're coming into this film to have innocent, dumb fun, then I think you'll like Minions just fine. If you're coming in for a compelling story that's going to be a big, grand adventure and stuff like that, then you're probably not going to like this movie very much. But my expectations for this film was either half that I was going to hate it like most of the cartoon community, or I was going to find it okay find it dumb, but has some fun. And that's exactly how I feel about the film. Minions is a dumb movie. Through and through, it is a dumb movie. That being said, it's also a lot of fun. My favorite scene in particular is the whole bank robbery scene towards probably the middle of the movie. That... That scene always makes me laugh, and, well, I've only seen this once, so it made me laugh pretty hard, and I had a fun time with that. I also like the scene where the minions capture the queen, that's pretty funny. Um, there's just a whole bunch of scenes like that that are just innocent fun, that it's dumb, but it's fun. That's the biggest thing I have to say about this film, is it's dumb fun. Now, like I said, this movie isn't great or even good, because there are some negatives, and I am going to get into the negatives now. Biggest negative, the minions. I mean, come on. After a while, they get 
ear bleedingly annoying. When they practically talk like, <laughs> banana, banana, for an hour and a half straight, that's, that is not something you want to listen to for an hour and a half straight. And that's, this is their movie, so it gets annoying after a while. Sometimes they can be fun, but for the most part, they're annoying. Also, I didn't particularly like the villain very much. I thought she was kind of bland and shallow, but... Um... I like the ending of the film where they finally meet Gru. That's pretty cool. But... This film... With the minions being annoying, not having that great of a villain, and... I can't believe I'm saying this. I wasn't expecting this a kind of slow start to the film. Like, I know they're trying to set up the evolution of the minions and stuff like that, but nothing really happens for, like, the first 20 minutes of the movie, and it's honestly a little bit boring. Now, I'd probably take that over the annoyingness of some of the scenes in this film, but you know what? Overall... I know I don't have too much to say about this film, but Minions is a simple film, so I don't have too much to say about it. Overall, my opinion on this film is it's perfectly alright. It's not bad. It has some very bad aspects to it, like I don't like the villain at all, or the Minions are pretty annoying, but it's dumb fun. And dumb fun to me equals a C. It's nothing that's gonna... Oh, this is gonna be the freaking Lion King of Illumination. Honestly, there's not a single Illumination film that's like even an 8 out of 10. The highest one for me is the first Despicable Me, which is like a 7.5. And the second would be the first Secret Life of Pets, which is about a 7 out of 10. So those are the only two I'd probably consider good. Maybe Despicable Me 2 also, but most Illumination films are dumb, sort of like this film. I haven't seen them all. I saw The Grinch from a few years ago. That wasn't really good at all. I'd honestly take this over that film, but... um. That's not the point. The point is, Minions as a movie is innocent, dumb fun. I don't think it means any harm, but it is kind of annoying. It has a pretty bad villain, which brings the movie down to be average, probably. So, that's about it for this review, guys. Stay tuned next for my initial thoughts of Minions The Rise of Gru. I'm honestly hoping I don't get what most people thought of this film and that film, because I escaped this film just fine. It's probably a movie I'm not really planning on re-watching again, but it was innocent enough, and I'm going to watch Rise of Gru, hoping it's at least a little bit better. I will also be doing an initial thoughts of Thor Love and Thunder pretty soon, where I will have a double review for this month for movies. Sorry there wasn't anything in June, or May actually. I, I gave my initial thoughts for Doctor Strange in May, but um, I don't think I reviewed anything else. This month we're going to be getting a double review of Minions The Rise of Gru and Thor Love and Thunder. I just thought this film would be fun and innocent, and something I could easily review, so... Stay tuned for my initial thoughts of Minions Riser Grew and other videos gaming do here. See you later. Bye.